Husqvarna is the largest outdoor power equipment producer in the world. Visit Husqvarna.com. Green flag, second try. Here we go. Boy, that wasn't a great start by Harvick that time. He did spin the tires a little bit. That allowed Dale Jr. to get out there. Jr. and Harvick break free of traffic. Johnson, a distant third. Fourth is a dogfight. Biffle and Kenseth. White flag this time. Here he comes. Harvick on the outside. Junior had to lift. Junior Harvick had to, to give the it lead. To him. White to give flag. It to him. The next flag ends the race. Those four tires, they were magic. But Harvick has run the bottom in three and four the entire race, made the pass up against the wall. Junior just couldn't do anything with him there. He was too strong with those four tires against his two. Fourth turn, final time. Kevin Harvick from the pole to victory lane, win number 25 for Kevin Harvick. Baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Good job, bud. Top 10 for Kyle Larson and 11th for Austin Dillon. Both rookies, both the top rookies having a great night. And of course, Mr. H, Rick Hendrick, uh, you know, once again, he gets outrun by some of his best, some of his own equipment. A Hendrick engine wins the race. Rick Hendrick's cars finish second, third, and seventh. Joe Gibbs racing, fourth place, the highest Toyota, and Roush Fenway, the highest Ford, Greg Biffle in fifth. Well, Kevin Harvick, this is a big win for so many reasons. You won at Phoenix, you guys had nothing but bad luck, and this is the Southern 500, and it was a shootout. Talk about this win. Yeah, the first thing I want to do is thank everybody um, on this Budweiser, Chevrolet, everybody from Sprint, the fans, Jimmy John's Outback, Chevrolet, everybody who's a part of this car, Hendrick Engines, uh, they've been great all year, and, and just these guys on this four team, Rodney Childers, and everybody who puts this thing on the racetrack. So it's just, um, we had to overcome a lot through the last several weeks, but we've had really fast cars. So just uh, kept our heads down and kept doing what we had to do. I want to thank Hunt Brothers Mobile One, Bass Pro, Haas Automation, and Rush Truck Centers for making all these teams go around the racetrack.